Right, and we're back. Apparently, we experienced some mysterious technical difficulties, but now we have returned. In any case, everybody was sneaking around, and it seems the Germans are calling for backup. What do you do? Um, keep escaping. Yeah, keep running. And uh, no, no, no. We aren't. We aren't escaping. We are advancing in an opposite direction. Retreating. <laughs> Retreating. No, we are, we, are, we, we never retreat, we advance. Our advance simply does not coincide with the... We're not... Crowds. Actually, we're not German, so yes, we can retreat. Yes. So, so yes, um, you, prote you pretend to not have hurt anything and you just keep going. Right. Yes. Yes. All right. Very well. <sighs> That's annoying. All right. Um, <laughs> so, uh, you're making a uh, run for it. And then uh, suddenly you have here, uh, actually Dries is the one who recognizes the voice, uh, the rather intimidating uh, deep voice from before, who uh, go goes in uh, uh, German, Germans. Uh, <clears throat> I know you are in here somewhere. Reveal yourself, intruders, or the local population will suffer. Oh, snap. Well, we we will not rest so. until you have turned yourself in. And yeah, if you do not do so, I will start executing villagers. He, right. he is yelling that while we are running away, so that's like... Yes. <laughs> it's, it's becoming fainter and fainter. We probably don't hear the last part anymore. <laughs> No, but he has a very loud <coughs> voice. He's apparently... He, he has a voice like somebody who's used to shouting a lot. A little bit like a drill sergeant, let's say. Uh, huh. Actually, he sounds... Uh, he sounds a little more li like this. We know you're here, Victrolas, and... Yeah, like that. Very loud right. voice. Considering only the professor heard that, it is up to him to decide what to do with that information. Exactly. No, you hmm. all heard this, but only the the, the professor recognizes the voice. Ah, before. right. And he speaks German, yes? Yes, indeed, he's speaking German. Bugger. He sounds rather scary, actually. Hmm. I'm not too keen on going um, back there to face him. <laughs> British pluck. Hmm, I I can't with that. Anyway, uh, um, yes. but he says that he says he will execute villagers if you do not turn yourself in. Uh huh. Uh, where? Mm hmm. Let's see. That. He probably has quite a grouping with him. He's going to ask for. Uh, I do feel it is best to, to pretend that we are not aware. In the long run, that will say. Uh. Is that In what you will run, do? Well, actually, on second thought, I'd like to roll a notice roll to see if we can figure out whereabouts he is. <coughs> Oh, uh, you don't need to bother. He's he's uh, so he's behind you. But yes, you're you're sneaking through uh, the bushes. And, How uh, far behind us? Yes. Well, you seem to be. He's he's standing at the location you were before, where you threw the bomb into the window. So yes. All right. So he's right. He's next door to the um, next door to the cafe with the resistance. Yes, indeed. I am certain Helena will come up with a cunning plan. But they know you're here somewhere, so he like uh, makes a threat, hoping you will uh, come and surrender. Exactly. However, we were we are not there, and if we play our cards right, we never were. And if right. Helena is smart as well, she will rat us out. I'm hoping that she has fallen for her charms by now. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I was assuming you'd say that. Uh, in any case, um, yes, you're sneaking through uh, the village. Give me another stealth roll, because there are more soldiers patrolling. 
Oh dear. Oh, no. Remind me to commandeer a vehicle. And um, I will David roll for Earth Mr. Whitney. Fisher. Because we need to get, we need to find a coffin. <laughs> we need to find a coffin so we can, so we can log the professor with us undetected. Wow, Trace, your rolls. You rolled a one. Luckily, the other one was a, was a um, yes. five. Three. Anyway, I aced S. A. Fisher's roll. Uh, that's it's a, a fourteen free. in total. He is a ghost. I aced my, I aced my first D six as well, so I have a total of seven. Oh, Trace, well. what did you get? A five or yes, a five, right? A three in total, then. Oh! Oh, yes, you don't have stealth. Stealth, indeed. We're mocking him about it constantly. Yes. Why doesn't the captain use his. Oh, no, wait. Uh, I don't have the. Never mind. Was it. No, never mind. I was going to mention command, but command doesn't uh, give you bonuses on those rolls. Uh, Nope. I checked. Unfortunately. So yes, uh, you're sneaking about, and it doesn't take too much too long before you're noticed again. Uh, is it a professor? Yes, it was a professor. This time he stepped on the tail of a cat. What is this with cats here? <laughs> I sigh. That's for them. You know, I tell the rest from. You know what? Just what leave das? me behind. I can take my. Uh, I can take care of myself. You sure? Yes. Go. Give me a moment. Uh, yeah, yeah so I've... that's what you say. Mm-hmm. Very well. Mm, reluctant, reluctantly agree to do so. And I also give them. Mm, let me see. Should I give them one of my big weapons or my binocular? Uh, some of my stuff. Yes, you had some gear with you. That is true. <coughs> uh-huh. You have the wire cutters and the binoculars. Remember? Yes, that's what I give to them. Oh, okay. And the cyanide pill I no. took somewhere else. <laughs> Good. I will not accept it. So the and rest we... you keep with you, all of your other gear and your uh, and your uh, pistol and your machete. Mm-hmm. You keep all of that with you. Very well. So everybody else sneaks off while a uh, German soldier uh, comes closer to you. Mm. Yes, he knows you're there, so he immediately goes, Hande hoch! <laughs> I come out of the bushes and say in German, Ah, damn, I tripped again. I can't believe I did that. Ah, oh, ah, of course. I put up my hands and, pretending to be startled, uh, uh, in German, what did I do? <laughs> Sold that. <laughs> Silence! Don't move! Yes, <clears throat> and uh, immediately, as, um, as you're uh, being detained by the soldiers, several more soldiers arrive, and accompanied by them, there seems to be an, um, a, an officer. And a quite a stark a contrast to the rest of your Germans uh, you've uh, seen, because uh, this one is actually uh, quite handsome. With um, with uh, he has blonde hair and uh, blue eyes, and he has a quite strong jaw. Yes, you'd almost say he's a he's a typical Aryan, and he's uh, wearing an officer's Uber. uniform. The Ubermensch. <laughs> no, it's not the Ubermensch. He's 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 just he weren't really called him skinny, but his bill is regular. <laughs> the Cthulhu mention. <laughs> Focus on not getting killed, please. Yes, yes. indeed. Uh, and then and then uh, the officer. Um, well, you probably don't know anything about uh, military uh, ta- tags and and insignia and what have you, so you don't really know what his rank is. But in any case, he says in German, of course. This mm-hmm. is the intruder you've been telling me about. I have a hard time believing that just one man could have call, caused all this destruction. Identify oh, yourself, yeah. stranger. Um, <laughs> My name is Professor uh, Hendrik Janssen. 
Ah, you are you're, professor. You're Dr. Janssen. <laughs> and you are, uh, you are far away from your university, are you not, professor? By the way, do you pretend to be German or not? I speak with a German accent, yes. All right, give me a German role. Your knowledge German. <laughs> nice. Because Lucky in case I of the soldiers, it. I'm not going to roll, but this is not a soldier. Oh, crap. A five. It's better it's five. Are you happy with that? Well, it's an officer, so I probably get them back. I'm going to spend one. All right. Um, let me check the <laughs> mods. Five again. <laughs> so, yes, I am yes, happy with indeed, that. Yes, indeed, five. Very well. He then says to you, you are not from around here, are you, Professor? No, I am not. <laughs> Where are you from? Oh, that is just... Uh, that has such a variety of answers now, doesn't it? <laughs> Where are you from? Answer my question. And he like... Yeah, and he I like... It, when he gets more aggressive, you notice that, that the soldiers are, are like... Uh, they look like they're about to get ready to shoot you. <laughs> By the way, these ones are armed with machine guns, not rifles. Mm -hmm. I am originally from Belgium, but I studied at uh, the German uh, University of... Na insert name here. <laughs> <laughs> you could just say Berlin or something. Yeah, uh, the Good University one. of Berlin. Is that so? That's yes, very interesting. you can even check my references if you want to. Yes, indeed. We shall, we shall do that. I want to know who you are and what you're doing here, but we have no time for that. And As I told you, I am a, a historian. So <laughs> historian yes, so yes. Uh, well, I find it very suspicious that you're here and, and armed with a rifle, apparently. So... Hmm, yes. I was uh, warned that Soldaten, take him to the Gestapo. Oh, the oh Gestapo. <laughs> <laughs> oh, boy. Now, well, Commandant. Let's go meet Herr Flick. <laughs> <laughs> do you know what the Gestapo do to people? Yes, I am very familiar with the Gestapo. Yes, no, your your uh, keeper is asking you that. So do you want to be taken to the Gestapo? <laughs> oh. Um, what's his yes, rank, you Sergeant are, Captain? You are already being disarmed and what have you. What, what, mm -hmm. what is his rank? You have no idea what his rank is. Mm -hmm. the, the soldier just called him Commandant, but that's just basically yeah. what you call a commanding officer. He could have any rank. Mm -hmm. You could just make a common knowledge roll to try to uh, see if you recognize uh, various shiny bits of metal on his chest. <laughs> what, what's a common knowledge? A common knowledge is just your smarts, really. Ah, uh, uh, ooh, ooh, nice. <laughs> yes, indeed. Uh, That's an eight. An eight? Uh, he's apparently uh, uh, a lieutenant. Oberleutnant. So that's in English. That's a full rank lieutenant, mm -hmm. second grade lieutenant. Mm -hmm. I say to him, "Oh, but uh, lieutenant, I uh, don't think that is necessary. Don't be so harsh." Eh? <laughs> <laughs> oh, and why should I uh, not take you to the Gestapo? They are excellent at getting answers. Yes, but I am also here to meet with my former friend von Kammerstein. I think you we will had... run. To... Yes, first, first explain. Yes. We had our disagreements, but after some investigation, I had to presume that he hmm. was kind of right. So I actually came back to share my findings with him. Nice. Hmm. He thinks for a while. You know Herr, Herr Graf von Skammerstein? 
Yes, if and if I am sure if you Real contact persuasion. him, then he will, then he would say that he knows me also. And I, and if you contact him, why don't you say that I that I am apologizing for for our last meeting and that now I think that he is right. I see. But still, real persuasion. This is gonna suck. <laughs> he is thinking about it. Yes, this is a very Where's important pers- role. This will decide yes. whether he wants to believe you or not. Because Come he's on. in command, he can just ignore what you're saying. If he doesn't Come like on. your face. Oh, and Nico, cross your, do- cross your fingers for me. Done. I'm crossing. Oh, fuck. It's a You four. didn't cast enough. <laughs> I didn't, apparently. Uh, my persuasion is not good. Actually, the doctor has an ability to give you elder signs, but he has to be there to do that. <laughs> yeah. He runs back. He throws an elder sign at me. He runs away again. <laughs> <laughs> no, he has to say something encouraging or something in those lines. Or something medical in his case. <laughs> If you feel now, I'll dissect you later. <laughs> <laughs> not like that, though, I suppose. Well, it's not important. In any case, he, t- he seems to think about it, and then he sa- says, Very well, but we do not have t- I do not have time to talk with you right now, because we are tracking down a group of intruders. Soldaten, ah, yes. take him to the Gestapo, but tell, but tell them uh, uh, to just detain him. Ja, well, commandant. So yes, uh, that could have been worse. They take away your backpack and they start searching you. Do you allow them or do you try to hide something at the last minute? Um, let me see at my equipment. Uh, I think most of these things are kind of <laughs> military standing, but although wait. Uh, Um, they probably want to know what you're doing with British hand grenades. <laughs> yes, yes, that was also one of the things I Why gave not? to you guys, hmm? and also with my gas mask. My two hand grenades. Oh yeah, gas mask. I forgot. My that's gas not mask. what you. That's not what you said, Reese. You yes, need. But you were too fast. <laughs> ah. Is that so? Well, Dries, I'm yeah. sorry, but if you want to give all those dangerous things to your comrades, you'll have to pay me. You'll have to bribe me. <laughs> tom, 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 tom. Oh, well, there goes my last elder sign. <clears throat> no, it's not your last. Yes, it is. No, you still have one left. See? Yes, that's what I said. There goes my last elder sign. Uh, that's not what you meant, though. Anyway, shall we continue on? Yes, indeed. Uh, so, all right, then you have uh, given away your gas mask and your grenades, uh, but still this leaves you with some suspicious equipment. Uh, but in any case, I reiterate, uh, do you want to hide something at the last moment? Because otherwise they'll probably take all your weapons and what have you. I take my cyanide pill and put it in my mouth. The best hiding place. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> <laughs> that would be very stupid. <laughs> and you suddenly drop dead. Because <laughs> it dissolves in your mouth. <laughs> um, uh, I take my cyanide pill and I put it in, the, uh, in my shoe. Very well. Give me a... Don't say stealth roll because... <laughs> no, I was going to say something completely different. What is the skill called? Oh no, wait, they don't have that skill in this uh, rule. It system. would be called Slay of Hand or something, I bet. Yes, just give me agility, I guess. You have lock picking, but oh. no, you, you're not picking any locks. It is strange that they're missing a Slight of Hand uh, skill. Mm-hmm. Yes, but I just used yeah. agility, five. that is good. Hmm, uh, five. All right. He does not seem to have noticed you are putting the pill away, but the rest, yes, he searches you and he takes away your uh, revolver and your uh, knife and what have you. And uh, the lieutenant comments, oh, you seem to be uh, very well su- armed for a man of, for a scholar. Yes, I was told that these places, that this area were full of rebels, so I took precautions. Men yes. should always be prepared. 
Very well, take him away. And yes, you are uh, taken away. They actually take you towards the local uh, police office. A uh, small uh, building which is marked as a police office and uh, with barred with barred uh, windows. You <laughs> immediately feel welcome. <laughs> <laughs> And yes, you're uh, taken inside, and uh, there, this uh, there seems to be a uh, police officer who immediately wants to inquire what's going on. But uh, soon enough, a, a man shows up uh, wearing uh, glasses, a, uh, a a black coat, a black leather coat, and a uh, black broad rimmed hat. Who seems to be very interested in you? He immediately goes, Ah, I see, it's a new, a new arrival. Will you be needing some answers from him? And the soldier go, goes, uh, No, sir, the Oberleutnant von, Wolf, von, von Wolfstein has commanded that uh, this man is simply detained. Hmm. Very well, I will follow orders. Any like any gestures towards the constable, and he and he and he says, lock him up in the cells. And uh, the constable, who seems to be a local, reluctantly follows the orders and accompanies the professor to a cell. He speaks <laughs> German, but he has quite a heavy Czechian accent, so you can tell he's a local. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> yes, and with that we head back to our SKPs. You have managed to evade the uh, German forces for the time being, but for how much longer? Um, let me check how long they will stay on alert first. So I actually have. I think I hold that. them up long enough to for them to sneak away. <laughs> yes, yes, but you didn't hold up all of them. Like, for instance, the second-in-command was still going around uh, searching places. But you did distract the, go uh, the, the leader of the group. Mm, all right, they will be on alert for that long, I see. Rolling. Ooh, nasty. Oh, yes, no. they want to be very thorough. Oh, crap. So where are you going to sneak towards? Actually, the uh, locals seem to think it's best to hide in the forest for the time being. I'll follow Emil. He has not led us yeah. astray so far. Follow Emil. Yes, in that case, you're currently in Karlstein. He leads you toward the north, in towards, towards the... Ca well, in the general direction of the castle. Not directly towards it, but in the general mm -hmm. direction of the castle and into the woods surrounding it. I see we're also going uphill. Oh yes you are, indeed. Good. Good of you to notice. Now then, more sneaking about it is. Yes, unfortunately even though you're in the forest, a, a patrol is bound to come around uh, sooner or later. So, do you have a plan, or do you just um, are you just planning on hiding, hoping that nobody will notice you? Hmm. Um, we're going to look for a de for a depression in the ground, and um, quickly, I'll, and quickly rustle up a bit of a uh, of a camouflaged foxhole, uh, using a using our combat knives to. Uh, and your entrenching um, tools. Um, and your and entrenching tools to quickly find quick and um, fix up a foxhole, covering up with the local bushes. Yes, the resistance knives, member help you with this. Good, because we have both knives and entrenching tools, but not enough hands. Yes, indeed. But now you do. Yes, and we're using the local knowledge. You know. What what is a what is a uh, ill used pathway, or whatever? But nobody comes. Yes, but luckily for you, the uh, forest seems to be quite quite a quite dense forest. Ah, but so as oh, long yes. as we're keeping. Yes, indeed. 
And Trace, you it seems you dodged a bullet there. Mm-hmm. Because otherwise you would have faced Nazi torture. <laughs> I mean, what am I saying? Gestapo torture. <laughs> <laughs> no, there's a difference. Mm -hmm. Yes, indeed. Nazi and torture. You, and, <laughs> and, the, and the Gestapo uh, member you met seemed very anxious to ask you some questions. Tell me, tell me everything. Tell me, <laughs> yes. Naughty <Not your> secrets. <laughs> Even better. I don't. Please, please, don't tell me anything. I am so <laughs> bored. <laughs> yes. But luckily uh, yes, for you, you uh, so the lieutenant has ordered you you to be detained and not questioned. Yes, the, yes. The Gestapo likes torture and black leather. Says enough. <laughs> 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 yes, indeed. Uh, in any case, um, yes, you're hiding at the moment. Give me a stealth roll because it seems a patrol is passing by. <laughs> Sorry. Maybe I am a spy. <laughs> I've got a six. Nico, oh, no. roll stealth. Mm hmm. I mm -hmm. do hope we have a bonus due to the fact that we prepared for this. Uh... Oh wow, I aced that. Let's oh dear, Mr. This. Fisher rolled quite badly. Should I spend one of his elder signs? Because it's not like nah. him to mess up like this. Indeed, he spend would one... spend... Yes, indeed. I only rolled a five. Only. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Ah, he oh, of course he aced this roll. That's that's more like him. He it has a total indeed. of fifteen. Yes, he's Mister <laughs> Super Stealth. What about me? Just I rolled a five. Call him Snake. Uh, yes, you rolled a five. You said. Yes. Nico, I've told you this last time, but leave your di your dice Sorry. on your card until I've I aced, them. I aced the first one. I aced the first D four and then rolled a one. All right. It is true. But I will do this next time. Very well. Hmm. It seems the patrol has passed you by. They Ooh. did not notice you. Yes, and I'm awarding you a, a bonus because you actually are in... You actually made a hideout, so to speak. Mm -hmm. Indeed. Um, Which how we can long use are you time? going to be remaining in hiding? Because, yes, the, the, the patrol passed you by, but you think they'll come back again. Sooner or later, or they won't, you have no way of knowing. I whisper to Emil, um, how long do the how long does Fritz usually stay on the alert? We do not know it is it is wait, you're talking in German, right? Yes. yes. So he says we do not know it is different. It is different every time. It there's no way of knowing. An hour, two. But this is this is. I think you attract a lot of attention, so they will be very, very a uh, lot of searching. Three hours, at the very least. So you wait for a while. Hey, uh, yes. You mm, let's let's say you have watches. We didn't agree on this, but let's say you have mm. watches. It's not exactly uncommon for the late 30s for people to have watches, now is it? Indeed, indeed it isn't. Also, if we have a view of the local of the town, we could use our binoculars to have a look at um, the state of the beehive, so to speak. Yes, you're in quite dense forest at the moon, so you have to move out of the forest, so at least onto a hill. Or You up. have to move yeah. around. Are you going to do that? No. All right, so you'll wait for a while. Yes. So three three hours later. Mm hmm. It's Which would also. What time is it then? Yes, it's now let's say uh, two o'clock in the afternoon, and you are starting to get a little bit hungry. But you'll Hooray. be able to make it. You 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 think you'll be able to uh, make it if you don't eat? But still, you're starting to get a little uh, somewhat peckish. Because it's you've had. It was very early in the morning since you last ate. So. Ah oh, yes, that is true. 